Yeah. Baby, girl, you're so damn fine, though. Wanna know if I can hear it from behind, though. I'm sipping on you like some fun wine, though. When it's over, I press rewind, though. Talking bands, I got it. Benjamins in my pocket. I prayed in my truth for some robbers. Wanna know how I get my skin like this? Stay tuned. Yeah. I got the Glock in my robbery. 17 shots, no... Hey, it's CoverGirl Jojo, and I'm going to show you how I apply makeup to make this look so much better. First, you're going to get your Hard Candy Color Corrector in the color orange and put that underneath your eyes to get rid of all those dark circles underneath the second of eyes. Then I'm going to apply that around my lip area to hide my 5, 6, 7 o'clock shadow. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Now I'm going to use my beauty blender to blend that out so I don't have a prominent line. If you watch my other videos, you know that blending is key in my book. Now I'm going to flip that brush over and I'm going to use the other side to blend underneath my eyes. It's best to look up when you get into the inner crease of your eye, that way you don't poke yourself in the eye. And I look satisfied. Now I'm going to use my e.l.f. primer and my Maybelline Dream Mousse in the color Cocoa. And I'm going to mix them together. You're not going to want to put a lot of the e.l.f. primer because it gets oily. Now I'm going to use my flat brush and mix that together. You're gonna make sure that you apply that evenly and that all spots are covered and blended very well. With this process, you're gonna wanna take your time. If you're wearing any eyeshadow, you want to make sure that you keep your lines straight when you brush over them. You're going to want to apply more around the lip area because the lip area tends to crease, so applying more makes it not crease as easily. Apply less to the forehead because your forehead is usually the spot where you're not as active from.
If you have to, get close up and look to make sure everything is blended and neat. And remember to smile, you're beautiful. Now I'm going to use my HD Flawless Powder in Cocoa. And I'm going to use my full face brush to cover and set my makeup. You can never use too much of your foundation powder. Now I'm going to use my Maybelline Liquid Mousse and my Elf Primer to do the bottom half of my face my neck area. Now I'm going to do my neck area. You're going to make sure that this area is set because this is where everything transfers from. Again, you're going to want to be precise and you're going to want to blend and put everything in. Now I'm going to use my Maybelline Master Fix to set all of that. You want to make sure you put an even coat around your whole entire face because if you put too much, it makes you look a little ashy. Now I'm applying this to my neck area. You want to be precise with this and not overdo it. There you have it, a clean, no highlight, no contour look. Hello and thank you for watching. I have something I have to show you guys. I couldn't wait. Guess who got a green screen? I'm so excited for you guys. We're gonna have so much fun and we're gonna do so many different illusions and effects. In the mail, and I can't wait to show you what I can do.